Hi! So I haven't made a video in a really, 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 really long time. But I thought I'd jump on today because I placed an order recently from Tiffany Candle and Tiffany Candles. And yeah, I wanted to share with you what I got because it smells really freaking good. And yeah, a little kiss on the top of your head. And so I'm house sitting for a friend. And I figured it would be a nice time to jump on here because there's no kids running around in the background and just my dog who's a very quiet, sweet girl. And yeah, we're going to smell some wax and show the people what we got because it smells really nice. Oh, my sweet girl. So if you hear any other like small barking things, I'm sitting uh, at my friend's house because she's out of town on a road trip and she has two little chihuahuas. But um, yeah, and I have my live here. Yeah. So yeah, anyway, this is not my house, not my background, not my glowing hermit crabs. But anyways, so if you're unfamiliar kind of with vendors wax, vendor, online vendor wax, I can't tell. Um, they have a lot of stuff online, you know, that you can purchase. Like most people know what Scentsy is, I'm sure, and I'm going to assume. But with online vendor wax, a lot of the time, it's hard to know exactly when they restock their sites. So if you join their Facebook groups... Um, that's where they post most of the updates, just a hint. And also another word, I'm filming on a webcam, so it's not the best quality and I apologize for that. But I obviously didn't want to like lug around a camera to somebody's house that I'm sitting at. So yeah, that's, I'm going to go. All right. Nice seeing you. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So anyway, I am on Tiffany Candles, um, <clears throat> excuse me, Facebook group, and I have never placed an order with this vendor. And I saw Makeup for Lost Time. Um, she has been placing a crazy amount of um, wax orders. And I'm kind of jealous because it all looks like it smells so good. But I have been, you know, joining here and there, just different groups. And I'm not, well, everybody I think have, by now has ordered from Candles by Victoria, which kind of will always be my number one for, like, home scents and candles. But I wanted to try these new, well, not the, new to me like tarts and stuff <clears throat> excuse me and so I placed an order anyways moving on with Tiffany candles because I saw she had replenished her um, marshmallow sampler as well as her pink sugar sampler and obviously makeup for lost time is not going to order the pink sugar sampler because she doesn't like it but I like it it's nice and yeah she was pretty generous Tiffany was pretty generous with these samples I got five samples and her ship time I placed the order and she shipped the same day or the next day so it was here to my house in two days she's from Texas and I'm in California so yeah now that I've talked for three minutes I'm gonna get on to the haul so yes I'm gonna start with the samples and then show the samplers I haven't I've only sniffed the samples so anyway the first one is mint chocolate chip and I'm not gonna like hold it up because my webcam will not focus so mint chocolate chip is a heart-shaped tart and it smells like um, mint and like an artificial chocolate note. And it's nice and strong and it smells good. It would be nice to burn now that it's freaking 9,000 degrees. That's another thing. It's been 120 degrees here, which is awful. And none of this melted or anything. Like I, this will show like that nothing in here is damaged or greasy or anything. So anyway, this is birthday cake. And this smells like vanilla and, <clears throat> excuse me, something. <laughs> I'm not, I, I don't get birthday cake, but it smells good. This is um, coffee and donuts. I don't really care for this one. It smells like, kind of like a coffee scent, but there's like a, almost like a preservative scent we have this like gem and mineral store up in the mountain town where I live and it has preserved um, butterflies <laughs> and it has the same note that that store has which is interesting next is um, cotton candy and this smells like um, it smells like the big jumbo lip smackers cotton candy and then I really like this one. This is Satsuma and Strawberry. And this smells like um, 
It smells just like Satsuma. And I think it's the body shop maybe that has, obviously they have a Satsuma one, but it smells like theirs. You can hear the dogs, I apologize. So I'm going to start with the um, pink sugar sampler. I'm sitting on the floor. I'm too old for this business, you know? My back hurts. But, um, yeah, the pink sugar sampler, there's 12. I swear to God, they don't bark. And then as soon as I decide I want to film the first video in like 27 years, now they're going to bark. So anyway, um, pink sugar and strawberry. So the sampler comes in these, like, bear tarts. And they're pretty cute. I think the camera will at least show that they're, yeah, there you go. They're pretty cute. Little vests and everything. So right now I just smell some pink sugar and it smells really nice. It smells just like actual pink sugar. I don't smell any strawberry. It smells really nice. Nice. It's very helpful and descriptive, but it does smell nice. Pink sugar and shaving cream. So I've noticed, like, now that I've been reading and following and watching videos, everybody's crazy for this. Oh, I just ripped the bag. Oh well. Everybody's crazy for crazy for the shaving cream note, and it's interesting. So the shaving cream doesn't smell like the shaving cream I was expecting. It smells. It doesn't smell like Barbasol or anything. It smells really, really good. I like this one a lot. It's sweet and it's like, I want to say masculine, but it's, it's nice. See, it's helpful. I, I like that. I would like my house to smell like that. Oh, I'd like my car to smell like that. Yeah. That's a good one. Pink sugar, eucalyptus and spearmint. I like that color. Mm, again, smells really good. You know, I don't really even smell like the pink sugar so much. It's just like a sweet, calming scent. I, I apologize for those dogs. Liv, that's enough. Okay. This is pink sugar and cotton candy frosting. I keep looking over here like I want to look at myself. Sorry. Oh, yeah, that's very, very sweet. I imagine my like 12 year old self would have slathered that all over me. <clears throat> Still smells good. This is pink sugar and peppermint. <laughs> yeah, this smells like those sweet like candy canes. That's it's really strong. Can you, can you please tell your friends? Come here. Can you please tell your friends to be quiet? Yeah. You can, you can see where I kissed her. Yeah. You want to smell some wax? Is that what you want? Yeah, you smell it. Oh, she doesn't like this one. This is a uh, pink sugar and rosemary mint, which I've noticed is another uh, popular scent in wax is that rosemary mint. Oh, it's really soothing. This is, this is really nice. Smell it. You don't like that smell. I'm, I'm sorry for the annoying voice. I don't think she likes it much either. See, she's out. Lay down. Come here with mama. Yes, on, on the tarts. That's nice. They're very helpful. This is pink sugar and vanilla bean Noel. I get vanilla bean Noel and no pink sugar. So I noticed that Liv doesn't like um, smelling wax at all. So maybe when she's in trouble, I'll just have her smell wax. Actually, she's really never in trouble. Um, pink sugar and birthday bash, which is this little gold bear here. Oh, this smells like um, lemons. Mm. I like that one. I like that one a lot. I don't really smell any kind. It's like a sweet lemon. I don't smell pink sugar a lot at all. A lot at all. Pink sugar and fizzy pops. Lyria fizzy pops. Yeah. No, I don't like that one. It smells like, um, it smells like margaritas. 
If you drunk too many margaritas, you don't really like the smell so much. Pink sugar and flannel sheets. Oh, that smells so good. It's like um, a sweetened laundry. You know, I really like these. The pink sugar takes the back note in like 99% of these. So you just kind of get like a sweetened version of whatever is the front note. So like the flannel sheets, sweetened. The birthday bash, which apparently has lemons, sweetened. Vanilla bean Noel, which is already sweet, but sweetened. I, this, this is nice. I like this. <clears throat> Pink sugar and blue sugar. Hmm. I'm not so crazy about blue sugar, blue sugar, but it's okay. It has a weird under smell, blue sugar. And then the last one is pink sugar and bubble gum. <laughs> yeah, so that smells like um, bazooka bubble gum. So yeah, that was a pretty cool sample. I really like that. Hmm, I wonder if she has any more. Um, yeah, so next is the marshmallow sampler. And it's cool. It looks like a big bag of gummy bears, right? I... I like the sampler idea. I think I'm going to check around to some vendors and order that stuff. I like that rosemary mint. I didn't think I would because I'm not a big fan of rosemary, but it's not rosemary. <laughs> so anyway, um, this is fluffy marshmallow and passion melon. Yeah. It's really strong. That passion fruit is really strong and the melon is just sweet enough. I don't really smell marshmallow, but it smells really good. All of these so far, except for that one, but that's just a personal scent thing. Uh, fluffy marshmallow and pink peppermint. So her peppermint is um, strong and it's already a little bit, well, it's pink. So it's, it's very... Um, sweet already. So this has kind of a chemically smell. Oh, it's in my nose. And I'm curious to kind of burn it. I don't have, this is my first order with her. I think I said that, but I'm curious to burn this and see if it still has that chemical smell or if that's just from the dye being, or the dye, the um, oil being so concentrated. It smells, it smells really nice. Fluffy marshmallow and vanilla bean Noel. Smells good. That's a nice um, blend. It's not very helpful, huh? That's a nice blend. That smells good. That smells nice. It's funny how, like, I like to watch these videos, and I'm going to assume you do too since you're watching it, but <clears throat> that smells good. It doesn't really help people, but it does. It smells good. <laughs> Fluffy marshmallow and lemon. It smells like lemon drops, like the candy. And that's all I smell. I guess the marshmallow just kind of keeps it sweet and light. Fluffy marshmallow and orange dreamsicle. It's funny how it's spelled. I don't know if it's going to pick up at all. Oh, it does. Can you see it? Dreamsicle has a K. Like sickle. You know. It smells like... A creamsicle. Extra sweet. That's funny. You know, I bet um, I bet the kids will like that in their room. Fluffy marshmallow and cotton candy. I smell really, really sweet cotton candy. It's light, but it's, it's still strong. I, I want to burn these, like, right now. Fluffy marshmallow and vanilla shake. smells, that vanilla is really nice and creamy. I like that. I like the really creamy vanillas. I want my car to smell like that because it's not that overpowering sick vanilla. It's nice. That It's nice. It's nice. It's creamy. Again, I like that. Mmm. Fluffy marshmallow and pistachio pudding cake. I love pistachio smells. I'm sad. I'm still sad that <clears throat> I missed two different vendors pistachio samplers and now I'm like, I'm eagle-eyeing those. I'm, I'm sad, but Oh, it smells so good. It smells like when you open a box of um, Jello. <clears throat> God, excuse me, the Jello um, pudding mix, 
and it's just like, poof. yeah, this, this is yum. I'd buy like 15 of those. That smells divine. Fluffy marshmallow and waffle cone. It smells like, you know, those, those Christmas tree, um, air fresheners in the vanilla scent. It smells like that. I don't, I don't really know about that one yet. Maybe it needs to sit a little bit. Fluffy marshmallow and Macintosh apple. Mm. Yeah, that's good. I love apple scents as well. This one needs to definitely sit a little bit longer, but it has the potential to be amazing. It has um, a hairspray note. Fluffy marshmallow and pink sugar. It's a lot of pink sugar. Mm, and it smells like pink sugar, so I guess it's a good thing that I like the pink sugar. Because I have quite a bit to work through here. Fluffy marshmallow and fruity loops. It smells like the bottom of the Fruit Loops bag with the powder. I've actually, this is kind of interesting, I've never actually smelled a Fruit Loops dupe, and so now I can say that I have, and it smells just like Fruit Loops. Fluffy marshmallow and cookies and cream. This doesn't smell anything like I thought it would smell. It smells fruity. Interesting. It smells like fruit. And marshmallows and last is fluffy marshmallow and lavender oh I really like lavender scents this smells like um, like baby's bedtime wash because it's that sweet lavender this is really nice and it's this will be burned next to my bed during like finals week because I'm still in school and it's killing me. I'm almost finally freaking done with my prereqs for nursing school. And I can't pass chemistry. So if any of y'all watching are good at chemistry, please teach me. Because I, I can't. So, yeah. That is my haul from, well, my sampler haul from Tiffany Candles. So, I do have another haul. It's a small one coming from Sassy Girl Aroma. And a really small one coming from Super Tarts. And, yeah, um... This is a dangerous, like, I don't want to say addiction, but this is a dangerous, like, thing to get into because everything smells so good and everything, again, is that kind of, like, limited edition. Enough, Dexter, that limited edition thing. You're like, oh, I need it, I need it, but it's not because you need it. It's because it, it smells so good and you want your house to smell like that. And yeah, so, anyway, I'm freaking thrilled with just about every set in the sampler, but... Yeah, um, I, I'm going to try to get back on the regular, semi-regular video thing again, and <sighs> life. But yeah, anyway, thanks for watching. <laughs>